Is this a good time to buy VeChain? Welcome back guys, it's Crypto Rocco from Rockstar Trading Channel. Earlier this week I asked you guys which coins do you want me to make a technical analysis video on. You requested VeChain and XRP. I made an XRP video earlier on. This is my VeChain video. If you want me to make any other altcoin videos, comment below this video which coins you want me to cover. I'll do another poll next week and the top two coins I'll make a video on. If you want me to carry on making VeChain videos, just hit that like button and comment something about VeChain or just type in V. ET and I'll make a VeChain video next week. VeChain, whatever you say about VeChain price dropping, but VeChain fundamentally is one of the strongest cryptocurrencies and use cases. I don't think there's anyone apart from you know Ethereum and Bitcoin that can compete with VeChain. But VeChain isn't as popular. It's popular on my channel, but lots of, it doesn't have the hype as much as you know XRP or Cardano or some of the other coins. But fundamentally, it is a strong coin. So in this video, guys, I'll be talking about the two big news for for VeChain in my opinion and then guys i'll be sharing with you my technical analysis and price prediction and as usual guys on this channel i don't usually i don't just talk about price going up or down i share with you exactly which coins i'm looking to buy sell targets and all the live trades also before i get started i am doing a live stream in in about an hour or so so if you're watching this video i'm probably doing a live stream so hit that like button and check us out join our live stream you can subscribe turn on the notification button and um, uh, join our live stream i share with you live trades and it's really important again before i talk about this video uh, one of the key things that we'll be looking at is bitcoin breaking above 20k is if bitcoin is not above 20k uh, the bit of the v chain trade setup i'll be sharing with you i'm not going to look to buy and we could go lower this is so important what bitcoin does in the next uh, next week next few days is is, is is important for the whole cryptocurrency market because in its history bitcoin has never broken below its previous all-time high if you look at the Bitcoin charts, um, go back in history of Bitcoin, Bitcoin has never broken previous all-time high. If you go back in 2017, 2014, it's always made a low above there. So this is really big. Unless Bitcoin can get quickly above 20K, we could have a big sell-off. There's lots of other bearish news that's going on as well. I'll cover all of that in the live stream. So click that, hit the like button, subscribe to the channel. And um, yes, I'll see you on that live stream. Now let's get into the VeChain video. The reason I'm talking about Bitcoin is it's really important to understand what's happening with Bitcoin before uh, we trade altcoins. Because if Bitcoin dumps, uh, it, it could be one of the best altcoins, but it can dump a lot. So you know, Ethereum even dumped 90% or 80% went down to $180 uh, when Bitcoin dumps. So it's really important to see what happens. So you know, VeChain is again, like I said, I fundamentally is one of the strongest cryptocurrencies. But with Bitcoin, being down 60 70 percent v chains down 90 percent it's absolutely ridiculous but this is also gives you an opportunity so if you fundamentally like v chain this is the time to buy don't buy in a raging bull market buy now i'll share with you my buy setup i'm i don't hodl uh, v chain and I'll, i'm not hodling now i'll share with you what i need to see to buy v chain but if you fundamentally believe on this buy it now because it's such an amazing level if we start breaking down even more trend changing then maybe wait but this is at support so long term you could look to buy v chain it's a nice level to buy v chain what I would like to see for me to trigger my VeChain buy is a trend change in VeChain above 30 cent and Bitcoin above 20k. If I see that, I will be happy to risk not just buying VeChain. There's lots of other altcoins that are looking very strong. You know, Sol. I'll make a video on Sol, uh, Tron next week. Those two coins are still hodling, even though uh, Bitcoin is breaking down. So I'll talk about. Um, I'll make a couple more altcoin videos uh, next week. But if Bitcoin breaks above 20k. Um, V chain above 30 cents that will signal me a buy signal and I'd look to buy V chain. I think it would head towards 50. It's 50? <laughs> It'd head towards five, six cents. Apologies. Um mixing up two cents and 20 cents so v chain above three cent um i'd be looking to buy v chain around there targeting five cent six cent potentially doubling that trade let's talk about some news and then finally i'll share with you my technical analysis and share the exact trade setup that we are looking at so v chain becomes the first ufc becomes ufc's first layer one blockchain partner so this is quite a big news i mean we've already seen uh, ufc's popularity in cryptocurrency and they are they, they support cryptocurrency so v chain being the first layer one on a blockchain solution is quite big they could actually be using a blockchain not just you know partnering and then promoting it they'll, they'll actually be using vchain products 
to use in UFC in, in an actual big billion dollar company. So I think this is quite big. So integration allows uh, VeChain with strong association with one of the most important components of UFC's ma uh, matchmaking fighter rank. So they're looking to collaborate to custom original content featuring UFC talent and athletes. Under multi-year agreement, VeChain will own UFC's official fighter ranking details. How big is that? Let me know what you think about this news. So that is one of the big news. There's obviously other news as well, but for me, that is uh, one of the big news that I've seen for VeChain. And even in this market, you can see VeChain is still making progression and a lot of the Twitter and YouTube content creators don't really talk about it. The other big news that I like is the uh, VeChain expanding in Europe. So we already talked about VeChain doing quite well in Asia. But with this partnership, VeChain is trying to take the lead in blockchain in Europe. So demonstrating how manufacturers or retailers can enable true end-to-end -end traceability of products from supplier to consumer. I've talked about the importance that VeChain plays in the transportation network with, you know, using blockchain to uh, securely um, do deliveries and in the, um, in the, I can't remember the name now, but, you know, the transport industries, VeChain can play a big part and it's great to see they're doing all of that. The traceability applications gathering inf information across the value chain in, in using VeChain. So that's another two, two big positive news that I'm seeing. And like I've said, if Bitcoin can, if this bullishness starts in you know, the stock market, starts pumping bitcoin starts pumping vchain can do really well i'm not going to get too much into that but it's really important to understand what's going on with the whole market i made a video on um, I'll cover the in the live stream actually the importance of how everything is interconnected so if stock market is selling off there's inflation there's lots of economic bad news interest rates rising we need everything to line up so we need you know stock market start pumping bitcoin start doing well positive news there's a negative cycle with like um uh, we've seen Luna dump, then we've seen Celsius dumping, and then if Celsius dumps, this could affect three hours capital, potentially even Michael Saylor. And these are all bad news that keeps happening over and over again. So it's really important to get a good news cycle. And that would be, you know, a prerequisite to the trade setup that I'll be sharing with you. So trade setup wise, if you ask me for my prediction now, as, as long as Bitcoin is below 20K, I was looking to buy that. We didn't get that. I think that bit, uh, um, VeChain will do something like this and then potentially have another leg down. So it's not the prediction you want to hear, but in the Rockstar Trading Group, I'll share with you when I'm bullish, when I'm bearish. You know, I bought VeChain in the initial pump. Again, you can go type in VeChain. You'll see the exact trade setup with entries and targets. We're buying this breakout. Now we're breaking down unless, you know, we break back above three cent, break back above this daily moving average, weekly moving average, start trend changing. I will be looking for bearish setup. So that's the technical analysis. If you ask me what what I'm expecting VeChain to do. I'm looking for that. And if it starts breaking below two cents, I think it goes even lower from technical analysis point of view. And you have to deal with that differently, technical analysis and, and you know, fundamentally buying and hodling something, you know, I just, you know, dollar cost average, some of the coins I'm bullish in. But this is from technical analysis point of view. For me to be bullish again, I'll, I'll use that zone that I shared. So I'll be looking for some lower highs and then breakout. I'll be looking for a pullback entry. And if you have been watching our channel, we look for a breakout, pull back to four hour moving average and Fibonacci is on 50.618 to find the best high probability entry to ride the trend. If you are interested in the Rockstar Trading Group, I'll leave the links below on the YouTube channel. I'll share with you where I'm looking to buy and sell. In the Rockstar Trading Group, I can post my entries, exits, and all that good stuff. So that's the video, guys. Let me know what you guys think. Do you think VeChain has put a bottom in? Do you think VeChain will start pumping? And also let me know your thoughts about VeChain long term. So is it a project that you like? So thank you very much. Smash that like button, subscribe to the channel. Check out the live stream if you're just watching this video now. And thank you very much for watching.